Ron. For those of you who yes. weren't watching, by the way, we're, we're having a bit of a garden gnome moment today. Because, what's the reason, Sal? Because people really like knickknacks at the moment, don't they? And yeah. Decorating their garden with gnomes and perhaps having ornaments, lots of things in their house. We're saying that might be going yeah. on the way out, that people that there's a reduction in, in gnome love. Yeah, and I think on this sofa there's not a huge amount of gnome love, is no, there? No, I haven't got any gnomes. <gasps> you haven't got any gnomes. <gasps> but, but Carol's got one. Yours Shock. is called Charlie. He is. He's indoors because I don't want him to crack or break in the cold weather that we have. Oh, but he's a handsome him. chap. Well, yes. you're, you're not the only weather presenter from breakfast who is gnome friendly. Have you seen Matt's, uh, who sent us in I, pictures oh, of his gnomes? Yes. This, this, is, this, <laughs> <laughs> this is Wills and Kate and the dog in the, the background dog? as well. That's yes. a real dog, by the way. Not a, like, like, That's not a gnome not dog. A, not a clay dog. No. But aren't um, they beautiful? Very nice. Wills yeah. and Kate. Yeah, Wills and which one? Yeah, I think Will's is on the left, <laughs> on the right, I think. Well done. Uh, but we are talking knickknacks this morning because, um, and thank you, by the way, for all the <laughs> thousands of pictures you've been sending in of your knickknacks <laughs> and, and your gnomes. Uh, are you surrounded by <laughs> shelves full of figurines, souvenirs, and ornaments? That sounded so wrong. Or do you prefer clean lines and bare surfaces? Always. One survey has found that the over 65s <laughs> are increasingly going. <laughs> For a modern look. Don't laugh. Uh, here's one who isn't. Uh, Mavis Till from Prestatid in North Wales gave us a great tour of her trinkets. A lot of things on here belong to my mum and I wouldn't part with them because every time I look at them, I think of my mum. These little ornaments here. The spaniel dog, he's got a broken leg, but you don't notice it. Um, this little dog at the back, the children with the geese. When the grandchildren were little, they always bought me things. And you can't part with little things like that because it's so cute. It doesn't cost many pennies. A little stone, you are my sunshine from another granddaughter. You don't part with things like that. That is what my mum made as an art class. <laughs> it's a bit weird, but <laughs> beautiful. Oh, Mavis, aren't they amazing? What a collection. Oh, no, proper collection. And that. sentimental things as well. That's what I do keep. I do keep sentimental things. Okay, that's all right.